This episode is artistic. Pretty drawings and lots of colors. Look, Lucy. Look how nice I colored in my coloring book. Are you crazy? Do you want to be frustrated and inhibited the rest of your life? Good grief! Don't you know that if you color inside the lines in a coloring book, it means that you're too disciplined, too conventional, that you'll work as a commercial artist? <gasps> Horrors. Okay, I'll try something different. Look, I'm drawing a row of trees, and I'm going to color them green. That's not art. I'll put a lake in front of the trees. That still won't make it art. And by the lake, I'll draw a tiny log cabin. That's not enough. You need a waterfall and a sunset. Show the sun going down sort of orangey, and put some red streaks in the sky, and have some smoke coming out of the chimney. Now put in some more trees, make it a forest, and have a deer standing by the waterfall. That's right. Now you have trees, a lake, a log cabin, a waterfall, a deer, and a sunset. That's art! Sometimes all you need is a good critic to launch a successful career. Why, yes. I borrowed them yesterday to draw some pictures. Well, what happened to the blue? The blue is gone! I drew a lot of skies. Don't you ever touch my stuff again! Understand? Great artists are always misunderstood. <laughs> You draw this picture in my book! Hmm, huh. I guess I did. It's a pretty nice picture, don't you think? See, there's a knight on a horseback, and there's a big dragon, and... Who do you think you are? What can I say? This is my book, and you have drawn a picture in it. Now I want to know what you're going to do about it. Do you want me to sign it? Peanuts! You see, I told you it wasn't too hard to make Woodstock happy. You just have to lend him your coloring book. <laughs> yeah, I know. To start off, you only let him color all the skies blue. Uh. <laughs> oh, he didn't just color the skies blue. He got carried away and colored in the grass, the trees, and all the bunnies. I think Woodstock is trying to apologize, Snoopy. You see, Woodstock? Snoopy is a more experienced artist. That's why he uses lots of different colors. Pink, green, and even brown and blue. Uh, well, it is his coloring book. He can color the bunnies any way he wants. The sky is many colors. There's a little bit of yellow there, some white, some pink, some green, and some... How about black? 
Because that's what your eye is going to look like if you don't shut your mouth. Ooh. Wouldn't you say the sky is blue, Charlie Brown? No, I should say the sky is many colors. There's a little bit of yellow there, some white, some pink, some green. And... How about black? I don't even know what's going on. is drawing in the air. Ah, I wasn't expecting something quite so stupid. Drawing in the air has many advantages. The materials are cheap, and we have lots of room in which to work. It's stupid. You can't even tell if it's ugly or not. It's not stupid. For centuries, children have been drawing in the air. I have merely taken an old art form and have given it new stature. I can draw portraits, or landscapes, or even abstract art. Looks more like art for flies, is what I say. Pardon me, will you kindly step aside? You're standing right in the middle of an unfinished portrait of Abraham Lincoln. Well, let me just show you what I think of your portrait of Abraham Lincoln. Huh. Interesting. Your tree is very expressive. Exactly what was needed in the background. Just perfect. Nope. It's missing just one final touch. I forgot to sign it. Da, do, 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 bop, bop, bop. 